Personally, I believe that every situation is an opportunity to learn. So, when asked the question, what is the greatest life lesson I've learned? I have to look back over my life, things I've read and things I've done. And the one that comes to mind most is simple. Just be yourself. I'm reminded of something that Oscar Wilde, the famous author, wrote. He said, just be yourself. Everyone else is already taken. I think there's a lot of humor and wisdom in that. When you're yourself, you draw people to you who have similar ways of thinking or complementary attitudes. It's the best way to know what you most want in your life and the best way to discover how to handle any situation. To just be you is the ultimate goal in my mind and the greatest lesson any of us can learn. So remember, just be yourself. Everyone else is already taken. Are you ready for today's actual story? Well, we just took a listen to it. Actually, we had to listen to what Kyle had to say. He is from Canada. And yes, he also did mention that every single experience or situation um, is something we can learn from. So it's very important. Every single situation is precious. Here we go. He says, Personally, I believe that every situation Every single situation is an opportunity to learn. That's right. So he's saying personally, this is what he personally thinks. Every situation is an opportunity to learn. So take that opportunity. Uh, take advantage of it. I have to look back over my life. Look back over something. Look back, just meaning to think about something. So look back over his life means to take the time to think about his past experiences, to think about his past. He says, things I've read and things I've done. So he says that he has to think about the things he's read and think about the things that he's done in his life in the past. When you're yourself and you draw people to you who have similar ways of thinking, he's saying that it's important for you to be yourself. So be yourself, okay? And by doing that, you will draw people to you. Draw here means attract. Not as in drawing a picture, but if you say that you will draw people to you, it means you will attract people to you, pull people towards you. And uh, those that have similar ways of thinking, those meaning people that have similar ways of thinking, people that think like you. And moving on to the final one, it's the best way to know what you want, uh, what you most want in your life. It's the best way mm. to know or to learn or realize what you want most in your life or what you, won't, uh, what you most want in your life. So here we go, just stressing that it is the thing that you most want in your life or as I said, the thing that you want most in your life. The order of these two words, they can be switched around. They will both make sense in um, either way, either order, okay? Uh, the point is, he said, even in the simplest way, just be yourself. By being yourself, yes, you will learn a lot. You will attract people that are like you, um, people that share a lot of things with you. So, yeah, I think that's a great um, piece of advice. Thanks, Kyle. Okay, everyone, take a listen one more time. Personally, I believe that every situation is an opportunity to learn. So, when asked the question, what is the greatest life lesson I've learned? I have to look back over my life, things I've read and things I've done. And the one that comes to mind most is simple. Just be yourself. I'm reminded of something that Oscar Wilde, the famous author, wrote. He said, just be yourself. Everyone else is already taken. I think there's a lot of humor and wisdom in that. When you're yourself, you draw people to you who have similar ways of thinking or complementary attitudes. It's the best way to know what you most want in your life and the best way to discover how to handle any situation. To just be you is the ultimate goal in my mind and the greatest lesson any of us can learn. So remember, just be yourself. Everyone else is already taken.
Now, uh, from what Kyle actually said, there was a part um, when he talked about being yourself, how that is the most important thing. But he said that he was reminded of something that Oscar Wilde um, quoted, the famous author. He wrote, uh, just be yourself. Why? Because everyone else is already taken. Now, if you are confused, what does he mean by everyone else is already taken? Uh, he did say that... Oscar Wilde did add some humor and wisdom into what he said. Basically, he's saying, be yourself because everybody else but yourself is taken by other people. Simply put, he's saying, do not try to be who you're not. Don't try to be some other person. Don't try to please other people by fooling yourself and trying to be somebody else, the person you are not. It's all complicated. You know, we often say that a lie leads to another lie. So if you lie about who you are, it's going to lead to a lot of complications, right? So the lesson is just be yourself, be happy with being yourself, and you will learn a lot from that. Okay, everyone, I hope that you learned a lot through today's lesson and had a good time. Um, yeah, I especially want to thank Mary and her father for sharing some great advice with us on the show. Okay, next time we'll talk about some choices or some topics requested by our viewers out there. So it's viewer choice one, viewers choice one, and we'll begin with a very light topic. We'll talk about hairstyles. Now, this was a requested topic, so please do tune in uh, for that lesson. In the meantime, come to our homepage, everyone. Feel free to come on over to www.ebse.co.kr. Look for Actual English with Jennifer. And if you have any thoughts you want to share, you know what to do. Post them up on our message board. Questions, comments, feedback, anything is welcome. Even a simple hello. Okay, that is a wrap for today's lesson, everyone. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll have to say goodbye for now. Okay, until I see you again next time, take care and bye for now.